and building forth the righteousness and the salvation of Christ. When you start to build forth the very grace of God, what we end up seeing that Christ is giving you love, perseverance, patience, guidance, gentleness, goodness, love, devotion, all the godly traits that are necessary to build forth the kingdom of heaven, and that his spirits of perseverance is built forth and edified. Each of these strengths gives more strength. Why? It is the very light of God. It is also the edification of the spirit itself. It is the soul that is strengthened. Looking towards Shema, Ra, that spirit is an actual nephew, soul that we lose, is that God is going to give us the divinity to show forth love, the Shakina, and that his grace builds and subdivides itself. Each one of the characteristics that we can have within God and the strength we can edify. So that it's one thing to have wisdom, but we can have more wisdom. Another to have strength, but there's more strength. It's one thing to work a miracle, but there is to work more miracles. It's not simply enough to create a miracle. You have to continue to create it. If Jesus had done one miracle and stopped, then what we would see is it would be an entirely different story. We wouldn't have the same view of the Messiah as we have because of the perseverance of the miracles that are brought forth in creation. They would want a sign. They want you to show them that it's the Messiah that works continue. We have to continue to build forth that perseverance and understand that in the same way, the very likeness that is given forth unto the Lord is also that same thing for each and every person to edify that spiritual existence and essence that it is that we are therefore edifying our understanding. How do you build forth and strengthen glory while you continue to do mighty works within this world? It's one thing to do something that's rememberable and another to continue and persevere, to do it every day. If your job is to work the gospel of Christ, or well, your job is to create miracles, it's to bring forth salvation. You have to have it every day and understand that you are strengthening that foundation, that you're strengthening love, strengthening splendor. It is to edify the victory, to give forth perfection, and the blessing come forth from our being. And I want you to see that. Here's my prayer, is to strengthen, to give forth grace and grace, and the love coming forth because of fidelity and faithfulness to our Savior. My message is simple. It's really so simple. Jesus is born. And I want you to call and receive the blessing of Christ Jesus. God bless. God bless America. And I'll see you.